This is literally one of the cheapest bungalows I've seen since I've been back in Pai. It's very basic, but everything you need, it's $7 a night. This is pretty much how the price of bungalows used to be back in the day. Like, you, like it was pretty average. You can go over the bamboo bridge in town and there's all these bamboo huts, different, ba like different qualities. And you can get them to like the cheapest seven to nine dollars a day. Now, if you go over the bamboo bridge, most of them will cost you no less than 25 a night or 30 a night. And I know people who's coming straight from America or the West is like, oh my God, that's so cheap. But when you were here <laughs> during the good old days of pie, you remember how inexpensive it was. Again, this is very basic, very old school, nothing special. But when you're not spending all your time inside anyway, then what's the point? Instead of, you know, like, unless you just want to do TikTok photo shoots and travel flex f for your friends or something like that. For me, I just need it to be clean, safe, a place I can record. Um, and that's what this is. It's actually nicer than the old bamboo huts I used to stay in because it was actually like, this is bamboo, but it's also wood. I, it feels like this is just exterior, like just decoration, but the old ones was actually bamboo huts. You know what I, you know what I'm talking about if you've been to Pi back in the day. There are some cheaper ones that will range you from seven to like ten dollars a day. A lot of them are like way out of town though, so then you have to get a bike. But near town in Pi. It's really hard to find anything cheaper again than $25.30. A few places have recently popped up that's around this price, like 7 to 10 I think it's because um, smoky season is about to start, the high season sort of ending, and I think the prices are dropping. Yeah, so I'm happy with this. I was staying at a beautiful hostel called Up To You Guest House Hostel. It was beautiful. I highly recommend it. However, I highly recommend it during low season because you think that it's gonna be quiet and tranquil because it's outside of the town and it's near nature and near a water stream. It's not because it's high season. It's still full of bro, shirtless, British, loud dudes. <laughs> the tipsy tubing every like, at least once a week comes past and it's just hordes of young people drunk and loud. So I would recommend that place during low season. I would recommend pie period during low season if you're not into the youth backpack drunk all night high all day type of scene but yeah to some of you this looks like crap <laughs> but for the rest of us who's been in thailand for a long time this is old school thai this is old school pie anyway i'm gonna i'm gonna go get coffee or something all right bye so yeah that place is called banana banana guest house so yeah not the most glamorous little cabin but it's really quiet which i haven't honestly i haven't felt since i've been in pie <laughs> it's super quiet like i feel like i had to whisper i'm just gonna enjoy the peace and quiet and i'm gonna enjoy the tranquility <laughs> Ooh, ice cream <laughs> Mm. It's so cute. I'm a sucker for anything that's Nirvana. Are you pricing me? How much is this? $2.50. So nice. It's actually not a bad price. <laughs> Yeah, I love these like rocker tees. Oh, it's so cute. Uh, 100? Yeah, one and lead. It's one to a lead. Oh, so nice. Okay, I will look around. Thank you. 100? Oh my god, so tempting. The price is not that bad. Hi. Uh, Just behind this carpet is my studio. Open uh, sky studio in a free park.
But I, I can pick up. Fried chicken sausage. This early in the morning. Swadika. That sounds good. Might have to get that. Chai. Ow, 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 ow. I wonder how. So I'm hungry and looking for something nutritious. Like you're good Yeah. And tomorrow I'm eating. It's Hanoi. Yeah. Hey, how are you doing? I went to Thailand and somehow. And it's like a beautiful It's like when they think. I do I agree. I see it too. Oh, homemade space bread is so good. Barbecue. Oh, that chicken looks so good. Tasty, tasty, yummy. I know, it's tasty. I look around. Oh, look, they have a little kitty zip line. <laughs> looks very family friendly. There's people selling in the grass too. Oh look, she's teaching them how to do the um, slack rope, these little kids, that's so cute. <laughs> You know? I don't have any. <laughs> oh my god, I want coffee! <laughs> Some sort of circus school thing. Lighting is terrible. Okay. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.